Hey, what's going on guys? Kurt Tashi here and in today's video I'm going to show you how to schedule a post to your Google Plus profile for free. Now Google has been really slow in releasing the API for this before they only allowed scheduling posts to your business page on Google Plus and that was a really they released that API pretty slow as well and the reason why is that they wanted to avoid people taking advantage of it and spamming the network which I can highly understand. Well after a while some apps came out that actually allowed you to post to your profile, to schedule a post to your profile. But a lot of them were pretty buggy, and you had to keep your browser open, and they didn't always work. And then some people figured out a, a kind of a, a workaround where you would, you know, put your post in your Gmail, and then you would send it out. It would go out to your Google Voice, and, and you'd do some other things. And it was a big old mess, okay? It, it was basically a big old circumventing mess, and it didn't always work. Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to easily schedule a post to your Google Plus profile for free without going through all that mess and all that headache. Okay, so the way we're going to do that is using something that you've probably heard of before and you may be even using it, and that's Hootsuite. Okay, Hootsuite is a basically a social network scheduler where you can schedule posts to all of your social networks through this one dashboard. Okay, very easy, very convenient to use. So I'm going to go ahead and log into my Hootsuite account here. Log in using RoboForm. If you're not using RoboForm, I highly recommend using it. In fact, I'll leave a link down below so you can check it out. Uh, makes uh, your saving your passwords and logging into your accounts a lot easier. So now that we're in our back office in Hootsuite, with Hootsuite on the free account, which this year is a free member's free account, you can add up to three social networks. Okay, if you want to add more, you need to upgrade to the Pro, which is like fourteen ninety five a month. It's, it's it's really cheap. So anyway, to add Google Plus in here, you need to go ahead and click on Add Social Network. And I've already added it on, so added mine in, so I'm not going to go ahead and reauthorize it. But all you would do is uh, choose whichever network you want to connect to, and then click Connect with Google Plus, and then you're going to choose whether to connect with the page or the profile. Okay, whether or not you want to schedule post to your page or your profile. And once you've done that, you're authorized your, your Google Plus, then you're all set. So let's go ahead. I'm going to go into a test test uh, schedule here. So first of all, let's go into, so let's go to my Google Plus. We'll go to, go to my profile. And let's scroll down to where my last post was. Okay, so here's my last post. I like posting funny little random stuff. That's the last post I did, and that keep, that was that posted. How recently was that posted? It was about two hours ago. Okay, I'm gonna hover over here, kind of, you kind of see it. About two hours ago. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and go back to Hootsuite, and I'm gonna find some kind of another kind of a funny little random thing to post in. So I'm gonna pause the video real quick. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and go back to Hootsuite, and I'm going to paste in something that I found, and we go and move my picture down a little bit so you can see what's going on. Okay, so I found a quote, or found a little, little uh, funny little random, random quip that says, I'm so old I can remember going through a whole day without taking a picture of anything. So that's pretty funny. And I'll, in another video, I'll show you guys where I find all my uh, funny little sayings and little quips here. It's uh, it's actually a pretty cool place to, to get these things. So anyway... If I want to, I can schedule to Twitter, Facebook, and Google Plus, my Google Plus profile. So for this demonstration, I'm going to just use Google Plus. And what I can do is I can go into scheduling. And I can choose the date, which I'll choose today. And if I want to, I can schedule it out. So let's say if I want to schedule out for five minutes from now I can just choose the time five minutes and you have to schedule ahead at least five minutes from the time from the present time so if it was right now it's 2.11 I have to schedule it for at least you know it goes I have to do at least like 2.20 or 2.25 okay this to make sure it's at least five minutes ahead so with this I'm gonna go ahead and just schedule it straight out I'm gonna post it straight out then I'm gonna go ahead and schedule a second one so you guys can see how the scheduling works I'll, I'll pause the video while we're waiting for the scheduler to to come up so Let's go ahead. First of all, let's go ahead and just post this one out directly. So, let's 
So what I gotta do is if I wanna schedule, I click the little calendar here. And if I don't wanna schedule it, I just click this X right here and I can click on send now. I'm just gonna click on send now. And then that should be my profile. Let's see if it's there yet. I'll refresh. And there it is right there. Okay. So now let's go ahead and schedule a post. So let me go ahead and pause and grab another another random random post. Okay, I found another a funny little quote or little clip. It's the most precious sound in the world is that of a laughing child unless it's 3 a.m. and you don't have kids. So that's pretty funny. So again, we're gonna do Google Plus. Next we're going to, we'll do uh, Facebook as well. And now if you use Twitter, of course, you have to make sure it's under the 160 character limit. So gonna go to schedule. I'm gonna post it today. Right now it's 214, so I'm gonna go ahead and choose 220 p.m. is my schedule. I'm gonna click on schedule. Okay, it must be so it's it's not quite five minutes yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and redo that and close it out. We're gonna go 225 p.m. just to make sure. Okay, now that's scheduled. Now what's gonna do is it's gonna put all your scheduled posts right here. And you can actually arrange this any way you want. So the next post is gonna come up is the one that we just did. So I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video. We're gonna wait the wait the 10 minutes for the schedule to pop in. And then we're gonna show you, I'll show you where it's uh, actually posted to Google Plus. So I'll be in pause the video, I'll be right back. All right, it's been a little over 10 minutes. We're gonna go ahead and check our Google Plus profile and see if that post is scheduled. So but do Google Plus. Let's go and refresh. And yep, there is right here. And one one good thing about with Google Plus is that it doesn't say right in here like where it came from. It won't say like Hootsuite, where it doesn't Facebook. For example, if you go to Facebook, and then for example, here's a post that I just put. On my profile, it's the same exact post, of course, but it tells you exactly where what app posted it. So with Google Plus, what's nice is that it doesn't tell you. People will never know that it's, that it's been scheduled. They'll think that you just posted it yourself, you know, manually. So guys, that is how you schedule post to your Google Plus profile for free, simply by using Hootsuite to schedule your post out to Google Plus. And again, you can do it to your. You can do this with your your page or your profile um, with the free Hootsuite again you can only add three networks to it with the paid version you can add up, I guess like up to 35 networks that it works with so and that's like 1495 months so guys that's for Tash thanks for watching if you found this video helpful if you're on YouTube watching this please go ahead and like leave a comment share this video with your friends and please go ahead and subscribe and if you're watching this on Facebook Go ahead and leave a like, comment, and go ahead and share. And with that, I will catch you in the next video. Talk soon.